Hi, welcome to this interview. I'm Marshall, and here is my guest, Aaron. Aaron. Aaron McLeod. Hi, so Aaron, what do you do at Lethbridge College? What classes do you take? I'm in general studies. I'm currently just taking English classes here and there. Okay. Where this semester, I am in creative writing. Okay, so what what's what's uh, in creative writing? What do you do in it? Well, with the way my instructor does it, we mostly discuss different readings that we're assigned every week. And then he'll give us an assignment where we have to take a situation from the text and then add a creative spin on the instructions to it. Okay. In our own creative way, I guess you could say. All right. Uh, have you, have, is there like a certain type of uh, writing you guys do, or is it just like all around? Like uh, mm, all around, just so long as it's creative, it works. Though I don't think anyone has done poetry yet. Okay. Uh, how many how many years have you been taking this uh, program? This is my first year at the college. All right, awesome. So what what do you do for fun around here? Like uh, I spend most of my days in the cave, just hanging out with people in the geek club as well. Okay. Mm. When I'm at home, I'm usually writing or watching movies or playing video games. Okay, so so you're a writer. What what type of stuff do you write? The most I've written is fantasy. But I've been trying to expand out to science fiction and other genres. I just haven't found a good idea for those yet. All right, good. You're trying to expand your your uh, comfort zone, like yes. Right, so, what do you do? At, what does a geek club uh, do? Like, well, most of us just sit around and socialize. But there are also large groups of us who play video games. Sometimes we set up events or tournaments, like for Smash Brothers or. Mario Kart, or even just dance. <clears throat> Excuse me. A lot of people play Magic the Gathering, Pokemon, sometimes Yu-Gi-Oh! And sometimes we just go out for outings on certain nights. Sometimes we'll go to a movie, sometimes we'll go to a bar, sometimes we'll just go somewhere and we have no clue where we're going. I don't know, what, what, describe like what, what the recent outing was recently. Um, last night a bunch of us went to go see Zootopia. Okay. Is it good? It's one of the better Disney films in a while. All right, and given that Disney has been on a pretty good, ro somewhat. I'll just say this: I didn't like Frozen. That's blasphemy. <laughs> That's just blasphemy. Deal with it. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, uh, so you play? Do you play uh, video games? Yes. Yes, I do. I play a lot of video games. I don't really play horror games, but that's mostly because I don't play a lot. Actually, no. A lot of modern horror games just don't scare me. Fair enough. Uh, any interest in the games you've played recently? Uh, I've been playing Dark Souls 2 a lot recently, mm -hmm. as well as Bloodborne, Witcher 3. Uh, what's another one? Sins of the Solar Empire on PC. Okay. But those are the only ones in recent memory. Okay, so <coughs> Bloodborne and Dark Souls, they're, they are, what I've heard, are very difficult games. They are. To the point where there are times I'll start the game, I'll play it for five minutes, something will happen, and we'll put it down and not play it for a month. All right. All right. What else? Uh, well, so describe one of your recent uh, writing things, like a uh, said you write, you're writing a uh, fantasy, fantasy stuff, right, fantasy stuff right now. Like, what is what's one of the more recent pieces you've done right now? Currently, something I'm working on that isn't necessarily fantasy. It's an idea that a friend in the geek club gave to me where I take members of the Geek Club and I put them in a fictional medieval setting as mercenaries. Okay. All the characters have their personalities, their names, <coughs> and basically it's strictly for the Geek Club. It's full of, a, full of different inside jokes for the Geek Club itself. All right, awesome. And I guess that's all the time we have, and thank you very much for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you.